Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another frog and YouTube video. I hope you guys are doing absolutely splendid and staying warm. It is a balmy zero, I repeat, zero degrees Fahrenheit where I live currently outside right now. And uh, yeah, Allure Winter Song and the Winter Queen decided to pay a visit because the whole freaking driveway is covered in ice and snow. But let's just go ahead and get started. What are we talking about today, you ask? Five more things in Kingdom Rush that make absolutely zero frogging sense. Let's just get started. What do we got here? Number one, Smoke Beard Engineers. You guys suck. Because what makes no sense about you is the fact that you're capable of repairing something as complex as a Chomp Bot or a Mecha Dwarf within literally seconds. But I've been asking for days for you to fix the Wi-Fi at my apartment, and you haven't done it. You haven't done it. I ordered this, like, five days ago, and you still haven't done it. And you also can't repair Clockwork Spiders. Why? It doesn't make any frogging sense. Literally. Just, you know, whatever. Moving on. Number two. Overworld Maps. Now, this is something that's irked me since day one. And I will never figure out why the heck this is the case. Look at this, all right? On the left side here, we have the mobile edition of Kingdom Rush, the original edition. And then on the right side, we have the colorized version of the map. Why? Why do we have two separate maps for mobile and Steam? Okay, I get that one screen is bigger than the other. You could have transferred it over somehow. I know you guys did the same thing for Flash. Why can't you do it for Steam? This makes no friggin' sense! I just, I'm just so frogging angry, man. Whatever. Alright, anyways, number three, the kingpin. Alright. <clears throat> now, for this one, I would normally put on, like, a used car salesman's voice. But since they didn't have cars back in the day, they had carts. You know, I, I, I can't really do the voice for that. I don't know what the heck that would be. But with that being said, let's go ahead and take a look at the kingpin. Explain to me how the hell this thing is even capable of moving. This is the classic example of quite literally putting the cart before the horse. There is no fucking driving wheel on this shit. You know what you drive, sir? You drive a wooden Prius. You drive a wooden Prius with no fucking steering wheel, and that just makes no frogging sense. What are you powering this thing with? Farts from your huge anus every time you eat a piece of KFC from your bucket of Kingdom Rush Kentucky Fried Chicken? What are you powering this thing with, huh? I, I don't get it. I, I seriously don't get it. It makes no sense to me. All right, number four, enemies versus tower versions of enemies. Oh, boy. Oh, oh, boy. Classic example right here. Do I even need to say anything more? Do I? Do I really? <laughs> You serious? Number five, what the hell happened to King Dennis? Okay, can I ask you guys something? First of all, how the hell did he get so fat? Like, what have you been doing in your spare time? Just partying all day in Lanaria? Like, seriously, getting fat is my job, sir, not yours. You're a king. You're supposed to be running the damn kingdom. Not getting fat at the taxpayer dollar's expense. Like, this is ridiculous. Before in Origins, you used to be Giga Chad, and now you are literally getting your ass carried by two guys on a throne while you just take random objects and yeet them at enemies, hoping that they will deal some damage. It just makes no frogging sense. Mm, white people! Oh, man. Any case, that's gonna be it for today's episode, people. If you, uh, if you enjoyed this YouTube video, let me know down in the comment section below, and if you want to see another part, uh, yeah, let me know that too. This is Pox the Wise. Peace out.